These are iconic posters, guys. I want you guys to take a look at this. This is when my dad became the youngest junior middleweight champion ever in boxing history. Pops cap uh, become a world champion, beating Yoni Boy Campas, making him quit. Wow. He's Olympic like team. Home. Floyd Mayweather's right here. This is my pops in Trinidad right here. This was a iconic mega fight. fight right here. This was when fighters were actually fighting the top, the best of the best. Now, the, look, why hasn't Earl Spence fought? Terrence Crawford, you know, stuff like that. And how this can you forget this one? one. This, this is, is probably one of the most iconic ones, the bad blood fight. That means we gotta be iconic. We're Fernando Vargas' son, and hopefully you guys tune in on May 14th. I'm creating a dynasty. Open up your eyes to see. Nobody as high as me. No play with a king. Hey, yeah. That's my grandma right there. Oh, you, you mess with her, you mess with well, her. Well, not everything. Yeah. Wow. No, that's not everything. What fight was this one, Dad? This is um. He and he was razor bald for that fight. Hey, Remember? No, no, look, 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 this is the only boy. That's when he became the youngest junior middleweight champion in boxing history. Twenty-one years, five days. Yeah. This is my jefecita. She's a great woman. You know, I did miss having a father as a kid because he was not present. If he would have been there, I probably would have picked up some of his traits. She had to raise us by herself, me and my sister. He was a murderer and a drug addict. That took his life, you know what I mean? There was so much stuff that I had to do before I went to the gym. If I didn't do my bed, vacuum, upstairs, downstairs, take out the trash, put bags in the trash, I couldn't go boxing. And luckily, I had a great trainer, an amazing man that is so wise. To this day, I took a jefe up on the phone whenever I need some advice. 1996 uh, Olympic, Olympic gold medalist. There's three type of people in this world. People that learn from their mistakes, people that learn from other people's mistakes, and people that never learn. My biological father was a man that never learned. Wow, Grandma, that's fresh. That's all your dad. That's lady. Every man has a right to make mistakes, but continue to make them, continue to do them, then they're not mistakes, they're just choices you make. Yeah, look, there was a birthday party in, in, in Big Bear. So it was snowing, so they broke the piñata in the kitchen. I've learned so much from my father in those aspects of preparing. I've seen it with my eyes, you know, everything it took, Miss birthdays, Miss holidays. We would have Christmas in February because my dad was trying to. Uh-oh, not the bangs, the Feroz bangs. But I didn't like boxing. I didn't, I didn't want to take no them. Gustó? Yeah, but who yeah. wants to see you with your kids here? Yeah, true. You know. I'm going to bring her a lot of nerves because she thought it was over with my dad and now it's us. People come from a family of mechanics. I come from a family of fighters, so I know we got to keep the tradition alive. I, can I have <laughs> one at least of these? Look at this one, bro. Hey, Vato, you can't put that on. I heard that you know, Did you go to the Olympics? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Can I no, have a it's just something that I gravitate towards, and you know, now I see my whole family and the dynamic of boxing involved. If it wasn't for boxing, you know, we wouldn't be as close as we would to this day. On May 14, all three of my grandkids are going to win. By knockout. Group hug. We love you, Grandma. I love you guys. Grandma! This is where I'm from. Oxnard right here, baby. La Colonia Boxing Gym, where it all started. Welcome back to Oxnard. Thank you. Such a blessing to be here back home. I remember you in 1996 when you fought your yeah, way to the Olympics. You made history at that time. I became the youngest national champion in boxing history at 16 years of age here from Oxnard. Uh -huh. If there was no La Corona boxing gym, I would have been locked up in jail for life or dead. We budgeted some monies to put a new roof, to refurbish this as a gym for the kids to take after you. You are the role model that we really admire you. It's a blessing to be spoken of like that. On behalf of the city of Oxnard, I want to wish you guys the best luck in the world on May the 14th at the Forum. The city of champions, we're behind you. You're going to win. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. Thank you so much. Before, you guys go wow. to the forum, you guys have to come see where your daddy will put it on food. Damn, this is your old stopping ground. My own ground. stopping ground, Vatum. I wanted you guys to see where I trained at. This goes to show you that you don't need a million dollar right. facility. Yeah. 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 You know, it's nice. Like at the end of the day, if you really want it, yeah. go to work. You go to work. You know, I did this by myself. Yeah. I couldn't even get a ride to the gym. You guys got all the help, all the support that one needs to make it. 
Oh, come on, let's do this. Come on, vatos. It definitely gives us a different outlook and perspective, like what my dad had to go through on a day-to-day -day basis, you know? We definitely counted a blessing what we have in front of us. What my dad went through, he made him one of the best fathers I could ever mm -hmm. imagine having, so. That's good. Dad's first boxing gym, he came out of the Olympics here. What an honor to be here before our fight, May 14th. Look, you got fans waiting outside for, for pops right come here. On, come on, come in. Oxnard legend in the come house. On. Hey, it's all come love, on. it's all love. They got a lot of love for him, you know? They're proud that he came out of Oxnard. That's what I'm talking about. The respect that he did this all by himself, you know, he didn't have a, he didn't have a Fernando Vargas to come in and guide him and mentor him and don't make these mistakes. Fernando Vargas, my daddy on the mural. That's you, pops. This is all God's destiny. My dad living across the street, him finding this boxing gym. The famous mural, uh, all about Oxnard. This was historical, man. It just shows you the impact that you made, dad. People are proud of that you're from Oxnard. And it was never on the map and you put it on there. He didn't have a Fernando Vargas. He didn't have a life. dad. He didn't have he didn't nothing. He didn't have nothing. So he's so proud of his boys. He's raised us. I'm very grateful for it. Uh, being in training camp here, you know, I have grown men coming up to me. I still remember when, when I was a little kid and, and your dad would give out gifts, you know, uh, remember food. That. God blessed me with so much, son. I. I would feel bad if I wouldn't have done that. And there's people here that still got my back because of that. My dad did give us everything because he didn't have nothing. I can't wait for May 14th. We're working in, extremely hard. And, extremely hard. And, uh, we're ready this tomorrow, is, this today. Is our, this is our time to shine. Just we're pushing each other. And that's what I think is amazing, having brothers in this sport. step in there well you know maybe we'll win maybe no. you know we put in the work and we believe in in our god-given ability and you know the work we put in in order to be successful in life you gotta have that will you gotta have that edge may 14th we're gonna show you the Vargas brothers we are here and we want to stay here for a long long time trailer fight club presents May 14th, boxing is back at the Kia Forum. Trillerverse 5, Lineage of Greatness. Sergey Kovalev, the Pulev Brothers, Evan Holyfield, the Vargas Brothers, and Cypress Hill versus Onyx in an epic versus battle. Trillerverse 5, Lineage of Greatness, live from the Kia Forum, May 14th. Tickets on sale now at Ticketmaster.com. Text TV5 to 75303.